Hey guys and welcome to my channel. Today I want to do a bit of a haul with you. Um, so during the week, myself, my mom and my sister, we went up north. So we live in Southern Ireland, um, in Leinster. And um, we went up to Northern Ireland, um, which is a part of the UK. And um, we, we, we didn't really go with any purpose. Like there was no reason, like there was nothing that we wanted to pick up. Um, so I ended up picking up just like a bag of mishmashed random things. Um, and the majority of it is kind of like products that I would buy in like the grocery store or whatever. Um, but there's stuff here from Asda, um, B&M, a shop called Savers and Home Bargains. Um, so yeah, there's just a few bits dotted around. <laughs> um, so some of the stuff that I want to show you. Um, so they're just little cookie cutters. So this is obviously a gingerbread man. These are from Home Bargains. Then have a um, snowman. We have a star. And a Christmas tree. So we got these four cookie cutters and I think they were 39p each um, for the four of them and they're really good sized ones so um, we will make some Christmas cookies with Ava um, It's something I want to do and I just saw them there so I picked them up. To go in Ava's stocking um, we got this so it's um, a two pa pack of craft scissors so one of them has like zigzag lines. So one of them has like a zigzag line and then the other one is just a straight. Um, she is constantly want to use scissors all of the time. Um, so we just picked up these two for her. Um, and obviously I will be watching her when she's using these. We just won't let her go off on her own. That is from Home Bargains as well, I think. This Home Bargains. Um, also from Home Bargains, something that will go in Ava's stocking is this giant whoopee cushion. So... Um, Ava saw one of these in a shop recently and she was obsessed with it. Um, so I just saw it there and I picked it up again. It was from Home Bargains. <coughs> um, so this will go in her stocking. Which is kind of something funny. Um, also from Home Bargains, I picked up some OXO cubes. Um, so obviously we can get these here. This is an 18 pack, um, picked them up when I saw them there so I knew that we needed them um let's see B and M savers Okay, I think everything else is just from a different store. So I think they might be all of my B&M stuff. Um, so we went, or my home bargain stuff. So in B&M, I bought um, this. So the first thing I purchased was just um, a refill of my dish magic thing. And we can get them here as well. This is just a pound. Um, so it kind of works out the exact same as if I bought it in deals. Um, so that's that one. Um, also there I got um, two of my the toothpaste that I use um, so these toothpaste cost like $5.99 full price here in Ireland um, but I got two of them and they were £2.99 each so got those and then we got um, this huge um, Astonish Moisture and Protect Antibacterial Hand Wash which added moisturizer and vitamin E, 650 milliliters, and this was a pound. So this is really good value and I really like the brand um, Astonish, they're cruelty free and all that sort of stuff. Um, so this will be doing, because in the New York I'm going to start getting like soaps, um, actual like bars of soaps that we're going to be using, but this will do until then. So that's from B&M. Um, and then in Savers, we got um, some of this. So this is the deodorant I use. This was £3.99, which is really, really good value for this one. This is the uh, Mitchum Ultimate Gel. 
Um, so I got, we're going to get one of those, okay. Um, then we got for Robert this moisturizer, this sensitive Nivea for Men sensitive moisturizer, which was $2.99. For Ava's Christmas stocking, which might sound really weird, is this pack of frozen plasters. Ava is absolutely obsessed with plasters. Like, the child wants plasters for everything. Um, so I saw these frozen ones and I just picked them up for her. And um, we also picked up some vitamins for her. Um, so we got these Halibro Orange Omega-3 and Multivitamins. So that's the multi one um, and then also I picked up um, a calcium and vitamin D. Now these were on um, like on special and the reason being is that they are due and um, to expire in February 2020 so I still have a good two months to use them and I will be starting them um, like pretty much from today um, so yeah that is why Mr. Men and Little Miss Omega 3 and Multivitamin and then Calcium and Vitamin D. And um, I picked up one of these original source shower gels. And then finally, the last two things I picked up were from Asda. So the last thing I picked up from Asda was these two guys, e-cover washing up liquid. Um, so here in Ireland they cost €2.19, um, but in Asda they were on for a pound each. Um, again, so with these I plan to buy the big 5 litre one, um, just as a way to reduce the amount of plastic bottles I have, so just refill each of the plastic bottles. And um, so that's what I plan to do. I actually as well seen um, like a bar of soap um, that's specifically for like washing up and cleaning. And um, so it has like surfactants in it that can use for cleaning. And um, so I might try that out too as just a way to cut down on the amount of plastic that we're using. Um, but that will be something that I purchased in the new year come January. So these were a pound in Asda. So that's it guys, as you can see, there's nothing majorly life changing there. There's a whole lot of stuff that I could have bought here in Ireland, but I didn't, I went up there and bought it. Um, but you know, it was more about the the day out, I suppose, um, with my family, um, than what we really went, what I really wanted to buy there was something for Ava. Like, um, we're going to see Santi during the week, um, during the next week, um, and also for Christmas Day, I wanted to buy, um, like an outfit that I could use, but I couldn't find anything that I wanted. Everything was kind of like velvet and that would just irritate her. Um, so yeah, in that, that perspective, we didn't get what we needed. My mom didn't buy anything. My sister didn't buy anything. Um, but, you know, I purchased a couple of things. I made a couple of savings on a few bits, like with these, um, that would be a lot more expensive than it was at home. But again, if you consider how long it took us to get up there, the cost of the petrol and all that sort of stuff, like there was no savings at all, but you know, it's something that we wanted to do and we plan to do it again next year so you know that's it guys they are that is today's video i hope that you've been enjoying them if you've missed a vlogmas video um please do go to down below to um the the playlist that's there and you can catch up on the couple of vlogmas videos that i've uploaded so far um i hope you have a lovely day i hope you have a lovely weekend i'll be back tomorrow with another video and i will talk to you then Bye.